Hey, so um, I see you wearing the rap hat right now, and my my pops over here was uh, giving me information and showing me videos of you before. I seen a picture of you 11 years ago wearing the rap affiliated hat and stuff sure. like that, bro. That's some dedication, bro. I respect that. Uh, but I wanted you to tell the audience and tell me a little bit about what it means, what rap affiliated means. So rap affiliated posse is R-A-P. Is everything is rap, bro. Everything affiliated to rap. We're not gang affiliated. We rap affiliated. So, you know, as long as it's the truth, lace it. But it's more than that. This is actual corporation. I made this uh, rap affiliated incorporated. Um, it has about 20 DBAs that um, are actually uh, products that we're working on the actual franchise. And I'm not in this music game to make actual big profit because that's just my rap name, you know. Um, I just want to make the label and the, the logo stand out to everybody so when they see it, it's symbolic and rap that it was some real shit. You know what I'm saying, bro? Yeah. I don't I don't really care about the money, you know, because I'll always get money. That's That's my name, Big Profit. I'm talking about the music, bro. I'm trying to put out legendary shit that when you bang my shit, you're like, damn, bro. yeah, that shit was fire, bro. My my boy was that. And it's like, I got a group, you know. I got I got a few artists, motherfuckers that were here with me now, and motherfuckers that are long gone, you know what I'm saying? that. But, you know, we, we all go through that, you know. But but a real leader survives through all that shit, bro, and you yeah. keep pushing on through the betrayal and the, the backstabbing and all the shit that motherfuckers try to do through the back door, you know what I'm saying? We're going to survive that bullshit. We're going to, you know, get right. But it's just, all it is is just, um, like I said, it ain't just me. The it, I am the voice of, of the rap affiliated, but the posse's the fans. The posse's my family. The posse's the supporters. Everybody who, who got love for me, that's what it is. You know what I'm saying? So. That's hard. That's hard, bro. So I seen that picture from like 11 years ago. So how how deep into the like music game were you at that point? I went through depression, bro. About 20 years ago, I was barely doing my own recording with my cousin. Mm -hmm. He was showing me how to, like, put together my own shit. When, like, digital analogs came out, we was, like, recording ourselves. I, I had a fire little setup. I go to jail, dog. By the time I come home, my whole shit gone. And I was like, what the fuck? Like, this is... Whole studio, everything you had? Everything, bro. Damn. Everything. And and what, and I, I, wasn't, I, I wasn't hot to the fact that they took my shit. I was just more mad and upset that what was on it. Like, that was, like, my first cuts, my, my shit that I that I was, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I was doing my, like, my own punches, doing my own shit, like. And then, you know what I'm saying, when I came home, that depression of engineering my own shit fell off. Because I know I'm nice with the pen. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm killing. Yeah. But then when I, I was like, fuck that, I ain't going to produce myself. I'm going to just rap. This is R.E.P. That's oh damn! Did. So I, I went into that mind frame of profit, like just a rapper. I didn't even want to produce, I, cause one, cause a few cats that I was recording with, I knew they had to touch. So I was just like, "Yo, lex me, bro." Uh, you know? I, I, I've, I financed the sessions, that, cause I didn't want to go through it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I knew that it was gonna be me versus the, the machine, or just being in that mind state of like, "Fuck, I'm gonna have to engineer my own shit." And it's, I don't know, I was, I was kind of lazy. <laughs> but but not 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 to the point of being lazy. It's because their their mixing was was impeccable because they had years in the game, yeah. and you know. And I kind of like I I kind of did it. So when I would hear my like my sessions, oh my god, that shit was horrible. That shit was garbage, <laughs> trash on me. But but you know what I'm saying. But then again, when I heard my shit mixed, I was like, oh, I am that motherfucker. It is tight. Yeah. It's just it wasn't mixed. So. But then, yeah, but thank, thank God to Logic and all the packs that you motherfuckers provide. Because <laughs> you cut down the sound by 90%. Thank you. <laughs> that shit is a fucking uh, musical, what's it called? Snapchat filter. <laughs> Fire. It, it's crazy 